34 million people bought basic non-smart TVs in the last four years. We believe that a lot of them will look for options to play content apps on their TV as well. However, we don't believe that everyone is going to go upgrade to a smart TV given that it's a large ticket purchase. If you look at a lot of smart TVs that were launched earlier, for a variety of reasons, they've not been able to upgrade those TVs uh, with these content apps. We are now trying to change that industry practice. We have pushed the latest Android TV update to more than 3 million of our existing customer base. With the latest update, Mi fans are able to enjoy the latest Google services as well as access to their favorite content apps like Netflix and Prime Video. For both these set of customers, the basic non-smart TV customers and the outdated smart TV customers, we have something new that will make sense. Introducing the Mi Box 4K. With the Mi Box 4K, we give you an option to convert your regular TV into a smart TV with access to all the content apps that you love. So how does the Mi Box 4K work? It is super simple. Step one, connect your TV to the Mi Box using the HDMI cable provided in the box. Step two, connect to the internet. Step three, start streaming. That's how simple it is. It comes with your favorite apps like Netflix, Prime Video, YouTube, and Disney Plus Hotstar. Uh, you also get access to more than 5,000 plus apps and games on the Google Play Store through the Mi Box 4K. So the Mi Box 4K works with any kind of TV that you might have. Uh, it works with the HD TVs or a full HD TV or a 4K TV. With Netflix and Prime Video offering more and more titles on 4K, we believe the Mi Box 4K, your content consumption is future proof. Talking about future proof, the Mi Box 4K comes with HDR10. With the HDR10, you get true to life color and saturation for everything that you watch on your TV. With the Mi Box 4K, you get support for Dolby Audio and the DTS audio codecs straight out of the box. Uh, these are the most popular audio codecs used by almost all the streaming services out there. The Mi Box 4K comes with the latest Android TV 9.0 out of the box. The Android TV 9.0 brings a lot of new features. Uh, my favorite feature out of all of those is the Chromecast built-in feature. With the Chromecast built-in, you can cast from thousands of apps on your phone uh, to the TV. You can also cast from your tablet or laptop straight onto the TV. It's not just a regular Chromecast, but it's actually Chromecast Ultra built-in, which means that it will actually support 4K casting. Another useful feature of the Android TV is the voice search powered by the Google Assistant. With the Google Assistant built into your Mi Box 4K, you can do so much more. You can discover and play content, you can control smart home devices, and you can plan your day and your daily activities uh, with a lot of help from the Google. Mi TVs were the first Android TVs to get the data saver feature from Google, and I'm happy to share that the Mi Box 4K will be the first Android streaming box that will again get the data saver feature first. So how does the data saver feature in your Mi Box 4K help you? It helps in three distinct ways. Number one, it helps you watch more for the same amount of data. Number two, it makes you worry less about your data consumption by sending you regular updates on your data consumption. And number three, it helps you cast your local content on your TV without using Wi-Fi. All of this is enabled by a 64-bit quad core processor, a high-performing Mali GPU, a 2 GB of DDR3 RAM, and an 8 GB of eMMC storage to give you a best-in-class performance. Let's talk about connectivity options on the Mi Box 4K. It comes with an HDMI 2.0 port. It also comes with a USB 2.0 port, which means that you can connect your external hard drives or pen drives to watch your offline content on the Mi Box 4K. Uh, it comes with Bluetooth 4.2, which means you can wirelessly connect your speakers or your favorite headphones to the Mi Box 4K. And finally, it also comes with a digital out for you to connect your home theater speakers to the Mi Box 4K. The Mi Box 4K also comes with support for a wide variety of video, audio, and image formats, as you can see here on the screen. That's pretty comprehensive, right? So that's Mi Box 4K in a nutshell for you. Uh, it comes with all your favorite content apps preloaded, plus access to more than 5,000 plus apps and games on the Google Play Store. Uh, it's based on Android TV, which means it comes with Chromecast Ultra built-in, uh, it comes with Google Voice Assistant, as well as Google Data Saver built-in. And all of this is enabled by a best-in-class performance, thanks to the 64-bit quad-core 2 gigahertz processor driving the entire thing. To summarize it all, let's take a look at the product video.
Xiaomi. So that's Mi Box 4K for you. Let's compare it with some of the other popular streaming devices that are available in the market, which happens to be the Fire TV Stick. If you compare the Mi Box 4K with the Fire TV Stick, the Mi Box 4K is built on Android TV 9.0, which means that it comes with access to 5,000 plus apps and games. It also has a more powerful 2 gigahertz processor. And finally, it also comes with a Chromecast Ultra built-in. And finally, the Mi Box 4K also comes with support for external media, uh, allowing you to play your local files from your pen drives as well as hard drives. So that's Mi Box 4K vis a -vis Fire TV Stick. If you look at the pricing for the Fire TV Stick, uh, the full HD version retails for 3999 and the 4K edition retails for 5999. So what do you think the price of the Mi Box 4K would be? I'm very happy to announce that the Mi Box 4K will be available for an incredible price of Rs. 3499 only. It will be available at 12 noon on 11th of May on Mi.com, Flipkart and Mi Homes and will soon be available across all the other offline stores as well. We've also got exciting offers for all the customers who buy the Mi Box 4K. We have offers from our content partners such as DocuBay, Hoi Choi, Epicon and Shemarumi. So that's it from my side. Uh, wrapping up on the Mi Box 4K. I know a lot of you are waiting for us to talk about the Mi 10, but before we get there, we have another exciting product. And to talk more about that product, I would like to hand it over to Vinita. Hello everyone, I'm Vinita. Hope you all are safe and practicing social distancing. With all of us working from home these days, everyone is learning something new. Cooking, baking, attending webinars, streaming movies, and so much more. And while doing all this, don't you feel restricted with those wired earphones? Pretty irritating, right? I feel that. Today's product is all about freedom from wires. Presenting to you the all new Me True Wireless Earphones 2. Although True Wireless as a category has been around for quite some time owing to its convenience, we wanted to make sure that we get you a product that delivers on professional sound in this form factor. When it comes to audio, we Indians love rich bass, crisp vocals, and we want to be heard loud and clear. And that's not what I'm saying. We have spoken to our Mi fans extensively to understand what they need, their feedback, and their music consumption patterns. So although we took a little while to get this product to India, we made sure that our product team is working on perfecting the sound signature that's artfully tuned for Indian market. So in order to deliver a custom tuned professional sound, we ensured we clubbed it with superior hardware. So we added a massive 14.2 mm dynamic driver with titanium composite large diaphragm, which reproduces fuller sound, punchier bass, and a superior sound quality. It's not just the size of the driver. The secret to attaining such superior sound quality is to combine a large diaphragm with thoughtful engineering and high-end audio components. And that's exactly what we have done with this product. When compared to other brands, you will see that Me True Wireless is a clear winner when it comes to the driver size. In addition to that, we have introduced the all-new LHDC support the low latency high definition audio codec which comes with a higher bitrate and delivers high definition audio. Higher the bitrate, better the sound quality. And the reason we chose LHDC is because it comes with an exceptional capability of transmitting more than thrice the volume of data packets compared to any other default codec. As a result, you get a distortion free high definition audio and a more immersive sound experience. It comes with Bluetooth version 5.0, which gives you an ample range of 10 meter. In addition, it comes with a faster connectivity and stable wireless connection. It's quite an unpleasant experience when you're not audible on important calls. To make sure you are heard loud and clear, the Me True Wireless comes with smart dual noise cancelling microphones for an uncompromised call clarity. The way it functions is pretty simple. The algorithm works in a way that the microphone at the bottom detects your speech and works with the microphone at the top to effectively suppress 90% of the ambient noise and reduce it to 30 decibels. Quite impressive, right? Whether you're listening to music or taking calls, you want your earphones to be super comfortable. You don't want to worry about them falling off of your ears every now and then. 
They are ergonomically designed to be slip resistant and super comfortable. So whether you are at work or play, they are definitely going to add to your cool quotient. The half in ear design is created after mapping different ear lobes. It is crafted to give you a snug fit and a more isolated music experience. So you can go on for a long time without any discomfort whatsoever. Talking about long hours, the Metro wireless earphones come with a solid battery and quick charging capabilities. You can go up to 14 hours on multiple additional charges with the case and up to 4 hours on a single charge. That's a full day of uninterrupted music. So far, we have spoken about everything that makes this a solid product. High definition audio, beautiful design, perfect fit. Let's take it to the next level by talking about convenience. This product works with you, for you. The Me True Wireless is optimized with Me UI. So the first time you want to pair it with your Me phones, all you have to do is open the case and the pairing instruction will pop open on your Me phone screens. Just with a few clicks, you can connect it seamlessly in no time whatsoever. It's so convenient that the next time you want to pair it with your phones, you don't have to go through the process all over again. All you have to do is open it and they will get paired magically. It also pairs with other Android and iOS devices. One of my personal favorite features is the smart in-ear detection and gesture controls. The optical sensor placed within the earphones work magically. To play or pause the music, all you have to do is take them off your ears. To resume, put them back and they will know it all. You can also tap the right earphone twice to play or pause the music or to take calls. It's so convenient that you can also trigger the voice assistant by double tapping the left earpiece. Now you can change music, make calls or ask for weather reports without even having to reach out to your phone. Let's take a quick look at this product video. Pretty much it. A fully loaded product tuned especially for India with great design, high definition audio, amazing battery life and all the convenience that you would love. And all this just at a price of 4,499. But hang on, we have a surprise for you all. The Be True wireless earphones will be available at a special price of 399 from 12th May to 17th May. You can buy them on me.com, Amazon or any of our Me Homes. The Me True wireless earphones sound exceptionally well with the next product we are about to announce. Over to you, Sumit. Thank you, Vinita. That was a great presentation. Finally, we have a pair of true wireless solutions which actually focuses on the quality of the sound and not just on how it looks. I'm excited to make it a part of my life. Now I know that you guys have been waiting for long enough for the arrival of Mi 10 in India. So without wasting more time, let me give you the first look of Mi 10 5G in the India market. Mi 10 in India will come in two absolutely mesmerizing colors. The first color which I want to introduce is the coral green, which is inspired by the tropical oceans. The second color which we are introducing today is called the twilight gray. Now it's subtle, it oozes glass and it quickly merges into your lifestyle. Here is a much closer look of both the colors together and they looking gorgeous. While there's a lot to talk about the Mi 10, for everyone today, I will be segmenting my presentation into four different parts. Let's start by talking about this gorgeous flagship display. While the Mi 10 features one of industry's most color accurate displays, it is also the brightest panel which we have ever shipped in the India market. The display also is HDR10 plus compliant. Now this means that it adds dynamic metadata to the HDR signal. 
Simplified, it basically means that the content which you consume on the Mi 10's display feels more exciting, feels more realistic. Now a display like this is crafted keeping the professionals in mind. If you categorize yourself under any of these cohorts, for example, a designer who uses the power of their smartphone to showcase their creativity, or a professional photographer, or a content creator, this display will impress you in the first glance itself. But why do I say that and why should you believe me? Let's look at a quick metric which justifies what I just said. JNCD, which is also known as just noticeable color difference when compared with the iPhone 11 Pro Max is far superior. To read the data right, smaller the number, the better would be the color accuracy. What I hold in my hands today is a gorgeous 6.67 inch Full HD Plus AMOLED display. Now, if you closely notice, this is a 3D curve display. And this 3D curve not just looks good, but it also adds to the overall ergonomics of the device, making it one of the greatest devices for one-handed usage. While the Mi 10 features one of industry's most color accurate displays, it is also by far the brightest panel which we have ever shipped in the India market. The second important thing which I wanted to highlight today will be the application of the 20 megapixel front camera module. Now, the left alignment of the camera module basically ensures that it does not come into the way when you are consuming your favorite content or playing your favorite games. Now, as you can see it on your screens, the application of the front camera module is tiny. It's actually like a micro dot. Now, if you look at the visible aperture, it is at 4.08 mm. But if you look at the actual camera aperture, it is at only 3.84 mm. Like I mentioned earlier, this is the brightest panel which we have ever shipped in the India market. The max brightness pushes up to 800 nits. And under the HBM mode, the peak brightness can push up to 1120 nits. Now, no matter how harsh the lighting conditions are, or even if you are under direct sunlight, the in-screen ambient light sensors will automatically help the Mi 10 adjust the display brightness to always offer an eye-pleasing experience. Talking more about the display, the display refreshes 90 times per second and is combined with a touch sensing rate of 180 hertz. Now this basically means smoother scrolling and it also gives an edge to all our gamers out there when it comes to online competitive gaming. So let me quickly summarize all the talking points which I just covered. The Mi 10 features a gorgeous 6.67 inch 3D curved AMOLED display which is also industry's most color accurate display. Like I mentioned earlier, the Mi 10 features the brightest display panel which we have ever shipped in the India market and the peak brightness pushes up to 1120 nits. The display also houses a left aligned micro dot 20 megapixel front camera module which never comes in the way when you are watching your favorite content or playing your favorite games. The display also boasts of 90 Hz refresh rate, which is combined with 180 Hz of touch sampling rate to give you a smoother scrolling experience and edge in competitive gaming. Now let's quickly move to the highlight of the Mi 10, which is its industry leading camera setup. But before I talk about it, I would like to take a moment to thank our India camera team and our India testing team for all their hard work. And I also want to emphasize that you have never experienced a camera setup like this on a smartphone ever before. Allow me to give you a sneak peek into what the Mi 10's camera setup can actually do. Mi 10 is one of the few flagships out there which allow you to shoot 8K videos. It also comes loaded with tons of brand new software features such as color focus mode, portrait video mode and much more. Now let's start by talking about why 8K. We are all familiar with Full HD resolution. It's a resolution we have all worked upon and consumed over the last several years. Now if you compare Full HD with 4K, 4K videos pack way more detailing as it features four times the pixel count of Full HD resolution. But when it comes to 8K, it packs 16 times more pixels when compared to the Full HD resolution. More pixels allow more granular level details to stand out. Not just that, with the resolution so huge, it almost feels like that you are rolling two cameras simultaneously. Talking about resolution, you can always downscale 8K footages into 4K files and in terms of quality, it will be still better than shooting in native 4K. 
I would like to emphasize upon that 8K is the future of cinematic videography and all the content which you shoot today on the Mi 10 is going to be future proof. Even after 10 years, you can simply pick up footages from your archive and they will still be relevant. Talking more about videography, the Mi 10 also features a brand new shoot steady mode which is a combination of OIS and EIS and it produces some really stabilized footage. Now even when you are shooting in difficult situations or difficult terrains, your footage is stabilized and ready for use. Now let's talk about the 108 megapixel sensor. This sensor was developed in collaboration with Samsung's imaging division team and is by far the largest sensor ever used on a commercially available smartphone. Let's take a look at how big this sensor actually is. Now if you compare the 108 megapixel sensor with the 12 megapixel sensor on the iPhone 11 Pro Max, it's huge. The Mi 10 utilizes a large 1 by 1.33 inch sensor which allows more light to be captured and produces some killer shots. The large sensor allows Mi 10 to beat all its competitors and especially when it comes to the low lighting performance which I will cover a little later. Now let's take a closer look into the camera setup. As you can see here, the 108 megapixel sensor is housed in the middle of the top camera module. It features a large f1.69 aperture allowing more light to come in with 70 lenses and is also OIS stabilized. It also features a 13 megapixel ultra wide angle camera with a field of view of 123 degrees and is complemented with a 2 megapixel macro lens and a 2 megapixel depth sensor. At the bottom, you will also find a dual LED flash and a flicker sensor which is built within. The 108 megapixel sensor, which is also the primary sensor, comes with OIS, which means that it allows you to produce some great stabilized content even when you are shooting in difficult terrains or harshest of the conditions. Now, street photography is one of my favorite styles. And one thing to note about street photography is how intuitive it is. You don't have the time to make mistakes, things move fast, and there are numerous stories in each and every frame. Now this leaves you with even less time to frame a photograph accordingly. With the 108 megapixel sensor, you get that particular edge. You have more details in each frame, which allows you to reframe your images while editing. And also while you shoot, you have one less thing to worry about. Here's a beautiful shot from Shimla which our team clicked. As you can see, it has incredible dynamic range and one way you can appreciate the goodness of 108 megapixel sensor is by looking at details which are even further away. Let's talk about night mode. Now, like I said earlier, everything has been reimagined and reworked when it comes to the camera module on the Mi 10. And that's why we are calling night mode, night mode 2.0 when it comes to the Mi 10. Let me show you a few examples to prove this point. One of the biggest challenges with night photography on smartphones has always been the grain in an image. In the absence of abundant light, the camera struggles to maintain correct exposure. And as a result of that, noise creeps in. An ideal night shot would be perfectly exposed and would be noise free. And this is exactly what we can see here. The night mode implementation on the Mi 10 is our finest implementation of night mode ever. A large sensor allows more light to come in and is clubbed with computational photography which gives us an edge to deal with the absence of abundant light. Both the samples as you see have accurate color representation, are correctly exposed and carry bare minimum noise while retaining the details even in the shadows. Let's talk about the portrait mode. The portrait mode has been our finest implementation of all the learnings which we have acquired over the recent years. The edge detection seems natural and all the colors throughout the frame are accurate and the details are sharp. Making use of the new feature on the Mi 10, you can shoot cinematic portraits in 2.35 is to 1 aspect ratio like the one which you can see here. We are also introducing AI 2.0. With this, you get exposure correction, color adjustment, brightness tuning and it also helps with reducing the noise in the image, fixing the contrast and enabling or disabling auto HDR. Now, if you remember, few years back, we revolutionized the manual photography in the smartphone space by giving more control into the user's hands. Today, we are introducing pro video mode on the Mi 10, extending the same philosophy. And I can assure you, you have never experienced anything like this before in the smartphone space. 
With this addition, the idea is to emulate a professional camera experience through a smartphone camera. The Pro Mode comes loaded with all these features. We of course ran out of space while trying to add all of it here, so here are a few. And here is a video which sums up most of the features which you will be experiencing in the Pro Camera module on the Mi 10. While talking about emulating the professional camera experience on a smartphone, we just did not stop at adding features which help you shoot. But we also went ahead and added another feature which helps you when you are actually editing your videos. Now when you shoot videos in the log mode, you have much more dynamic information retained in the video itself and which is a much better starting point when you start color grading your videos. Now here is a quick video to explain it a little bit further. Now you cannot have a professional camera without the ability to shoot images in the raw mode and that's where the Mi 10 comes in. On the Mi 10 you can also shoot images in raw mode. Now the samples which you see on your screen, of course the unprocessed raw carries a lot of information which is not tapped into. But with the new editing tools you can edit these images and accentuate them even further. No wonder the file size is so huge. To sum it up, the Mi 10 uses a large 1 by 1.33 inch 108 megapixel sensor as its primary camera along with a 7P lens system. It is also one of the first few phones to offer 8K video recording. We have also built in a shoot steady mode which combines OIS and EIS to produce some really stabilized footage. With that, you get a completely reworked night mode, a new portrait video mode, a movie mode along with multiple exposure level controls and focus peaking. Let's quickly talk about performance. The Mi 10 in India will be powered by Qualcomm's flagship Snapdragon 865 SoC. Snapdragon 865 is manufactured on 7 nanometer process technology which makes it one of the most power efficient SoCs in the market. Now when you compare Snapdragon 865 with its predecessor, you also get the support for dual band 5G and support for the all new Wi-Fi 6 protocol. Not just that, it is also 25% faster than its predecessor and delivers up to 100% performance boost on the AI front, something which I already touched upon in the camera segment. Now like I mentioned earlier, the Mi 10 is a future ready device even when it comes to the network or the connectivity protocols. With the support for Wi-Fi 6, Mi 10 delivers stable connectivity and delivers outstanding upload and download speeds even in congested areas. The flagship Snapdragon 865 processor is also combined with industry's fastest RAM available for mobile computing which is LPDDR5. It delivers up to 30% faster performance with optimized power efficiency. Not just that, we exactly know how our fans will be using their devices. Hence, we took the call to ship the fastest UFS 3.0 storage across all the variants for blazing read and write speeds. Talking about the variants, there will be two options available for the India market. 8GB of RAM combined with 128GB of storage and 8GB of RAM combined with 256GB of storage. Both the variants will carry LPDDR5 RAM and UFS 3.0 storage. 
Now, with such heavy performance in such a compact form factor, thermal management becomes part of the business itself. For the very first time, we are combining vapor chamber liquid cooling, seven layer of graphite stack and graphene together to effectively reduce the CPU temperature by 10.5 degrees Celsius. Now, this is especially important for a country like ours where the temperature is already soaring above 40 degrees Celsius. With a triple cooling layer mechanism, which essentially combines vapor chamber liquid cooling with graphite stack and graphene, regulates the CPU temperature to deliver that sustained peak performance, which you have always expected from a flagship like this. Now, this brings me to the end of the performance section. Allow me to quickly summarize. Mi 10 in India is powered by Qualcomm's flagship Snapdragon 865 processor, which is built on a 7 nanometer process technology. With the new SoC, Mi 10 is a future ready device with support for 5G and Wi Fi 6 out of the box. We have also built in a three layer cooling mechanism with vapor chamber liquid cooling, graphite stack, and graphene to regulate the CPU temperature for sustained peak performance. Not just that, the flagship SOC is combined with the fastest RAM and storage options to deliver that outstanding performance. Now let's talk about power. The Mi 10 houses one of the biggest batteries when you compare it with the other flagship phones. Even with a larger battery, we have ensured that it does not hinder with the overall ergonomics of the device. As you can see here, we are utilizing a vertical battery design. Now, by redesigning the battery, we have managed to keep the frame thickness at 2.2 millimeters and the overall thickness at 8.96 millimeters. It fits firmly into your hand and it gives you a confident grip, all thanks to the internal chassis and the battery design. Mi 10 features 30 watt wire turbo charge with 30 watt charger in the box itself. But what excites me today the most is that we have finally reached a stage where wired and wireless charging have become equally powerful. I'm proud to announce that Mi 10 will feature industry's fastest wireless charging at 30 watts. Now you can also use the Mi 10 to wirelessly charge other wireless charging compatible devices because it features 10 watt reverse wireless charging. Obviously this is Qi compatible, so it works with all your other devices as well. So what you get on the Mi 10 is triple fast charge, 30 watt wired turbo charging with 30 watt charger in the box itself, industry's fastest 30 watt wireless charging and 10 watt reverse wireless charging, which is Qi compatible. As you already know, we recently announced the arrival of our first product in the wireless charging space. It was the 10,000 mAh Mi wireless power bank, which allows you to charge your devices wirelessly at 10 watt and if you are charging it with a wired connection, it obviously charges at 18 watt. And today I'm taking this opportunity to announce the second product in the wireless category space, announcing the arrival of Mi 30 watt wireless charger, which is Qi certified and comes with a fan built within. Please head on to our Mi.com pages to know more about it. To sum it up, Mi 10 is faster than ever with Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 and X55 dual band 5G modem. It also is cooler than ever with three solutions coming in together to effectively reduce the CPU temperature by 10.5 degrees Celsius. More power than ever with 4,780 mAh of battery and triple fast charge, 30 watt wired, 30 watt wireless and 10 watt reverse wireless charging with 30 watt charger in the box itself. The last thing which I wanted to cover today is the overall device experience and how your device reacts when you actually interact with it. We have completely reworked the haptic engine feedback on the Mi 10. Allow me to quickly explain. We are introducing X-axis linear vibration motor which simulates the feel of a mechanical keyboard. Not just that, we combined it with 150 different frequencies matched with different use case scenarios to offer a unique haptic feedback every single time. The second important thing which I wanted to touch upon is something which is very close to my heart and which is the audio experience on the Mi 10. To match up to the brilliant display quality which I touched upon, Mi 10 in India will feature stereo speakers. This is an intelligent stereo setup which works along with multiple other sensors to understand the device orientation and switch the speakers automatically. Now this is especially useful for games which utilize dual channel audio like PUBG and many others. 
Now, Mi 10 features the largest stereo speaker setup. It is 12 millimeter by 16 millimeters. And I'm talking about both the speakers, which you see on your screen right now. Now, if you compare the Mi 10 speaker setup along with iPhone 11 Pro Max or Samsung S20 Ultras, you will see that they are using disproportionate speakers where one speaker is smaller in size and the other speaker is, of course, large. Now, this is going to produce imbalanced sound because you need similar speakers of the same make or the same model to produce balanced sound. Extending from amazing stereo sound, the Mi 10 also supports LHDC audio codec right out of the box itself. Now, if you compare LHDC audio codec with a standard Bluetooth audio codec, also known as SBC, the data transmission rate is almost three times. And now that particularly supports the high resolution audio, which you have always wanted from your Bluetooth headphones or your Bluetooth wireless buds. Now combine this with the true wireless solution, which Vinita just spoke about for complete audio bliss. Now speed and stability is an experience. And to exactly ensure that, we are introducing 5G multi-link on Mi 10. This feature would allow the phone to connect to three networks simultaneously, including a 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi, plus a 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi, plus a 5G or a 4G mobile network. Now, this means that the phone will be able to connect to two different Wi-Fi networks and use the mobile data at the same time. This feature has been introduced to maintain a stable and consistent smartphone experience. So that's the all new Mi 10. It comes with a 108 megapixel camera with optical image stabilization. You get the support for Snapdragon 865, 5G and Wi-Fi 6 along with that. It comes with a beautiful and a gorgeous 3D curved E3 AMOLED display, which is at 6.67 inches. Comes with fastest wireless charging, which is at 30 watts. Comes with a 30 watt wired charging and a 30 watt charger, of course, in the box itself, stereo speakers and much, much more. You get two variants in the India market, 8 GB of RAM and 128 GB of storage and 8 GB of RAM and 256 GB of storage. Now to talk more about the pricing and the availability, let me have Manu back on your screens. Thank you so much, Raghu, Vinita and Sumit for taking us through these really incredible products. So we launched three Mi products today. We launched Mi Box 4K, Mi TWS that all of you guys were asking for and of course, we launch a flagship Mi 10. Mi 10 is a true flagship phone. It not only comes with Qualcomm Snapdragon 865, it has 3D curved AMOLED. It has up to 30 watt of wireless charging with 10 watt of reverse wireless charging. And of course, it comes with the incredible 108 megapixel camera sensor. Personally, I believe that in 2020, if your phone does not have a 108 megapixel camera sensor, it is not a flagship. You need to experience this camera to truly believe what it can do. When we were launching this phone, we looked at the entire industry and we couldn't find anything which is even remotely comparable. The only other device which has 108 megapixel camera sensor in India is Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. But I believe Mi 10 is significantly better. It has Qualcomm Snapdragon 865, which is much better and faster than the Exynos processor on S20 Ultra. It also supports up to 30 watt of wireless charging, which is much faster than Samsung S20 Ultra. 
And Samsung S20 Ultra, the 128GB variant, sells for more than 95,000 rupees. If you look at our global pricing, our China pricing of Mi 10, it's 3,999 RMB. And if you translate this into Indian rupees, it comes out to around 43,000 rupees. And if you add the latest 18% GST on it, it goes way beyond 50,000 rupees. I'm happy to share that we are launching Mi 10 8GB, 128GB variant at only 49,999 rupees. And the 8GB, 256GB variant is being launched at 54,999 rupees. Not just this, we also have exciting offers for all of you guys. Every Mi fan who buys a Mi 10 during the pre-booking period will get a Mi wireless power bank worth 2,500 rupees free. We will also have no cost EMI options on both online and offline platforms. And yes, every Mi fan who buys Mi 10 using an HDFC bank credit card or debit card will get up to rupees 3,000 back. So I hope all of you guys will really love these three products. Please take care of yourself. Stay at home. Stay safe. Take care, guys. Namaste.